Welcome back to the channel. Google has just taken a major leap in AI technology with the unveiling of VO3, their most advanced video generation model to date. Announced at Google I.O. 2025 and developed by DeepMind, VO3 isn't just about visuals. It brings synchronized audio, dialogue and background music into the mix, making it one of the first AI tools capable of producing complete, high-definition video clips from simple text prompts. VO3 is currently available in the US through the Gemini Ultra subscription plan, priced at $249.99 per month. Subscribers get access via the Gemini app and Google's Flow platform. It's specifically designed for content creators, educators, marketers, and filmmakers. Basically anyone looking to create pro-level video content without a massive production team. And of course, no major AI upgrade would be complete without a retest of the now infamous Will Smith eating spaghetti benchmark. Originally a bizarre meme from 2023 that highlighted the uncanny flaws of early AI models, rubbery limbs, distorted faces and all. This moment has now become a symbolic way to measure AI video progress. So how did VO3 handle it? Surprisingly well. The new version shows Will Smith's face in clear detail, body movement appears natural and, most notably, there's audio. Yes, the spaghetti sounds were described by some users as a little crunchy, but overall, it's a massive improvement. The AI-generated video now looks almost indistinguishable from real footage, at least at first glance. That said, there are still a few giveaways, minor background glitches, slightly stiff animations, and a clip length limited to 8 seconds. So, while it's not perfect, it's undeniably impressive. The public's reaction? A mix of awe and anxiety. On one hand, creators are excited about the creative potential. On the other, concerns about deepfakes, misinformation, and the future of trust in media are growing. As one viral comment summed it up, misinformation about to go up times 10. What do you think about this new wave of AI video realism? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech updates.